Right. Fed and watered. A nice couple of cups of tea. Toasted tea cake. Rant Gill. Few bikes out today. Can't, not surprising really. Bank Aldi Monday. Nice warm sunny day. Actually, a popular area to um, to ride around. Clayworth, another little nice village. A little bridge. Canal. It's a well used canal this. Right. Set off on our journeys again. Good turn left here and actually go over the Chesterfield Canal. Hayton, another nice little place. Another bridge over the Chesterfield Canal. Some lovely walks on this canal. I've done several with my pal Bernard.
Okay, this is another road I've been on quite a lot, uh, especially with Ian. Like I said, this is the uh, usual evening run that we used to do. Because roads are pretty quiet and they're nice and pleasant to ride. Yes, I've done one they're all going, now I'm trying out on this one. But I'm really enjoying this VT750. It really is a nice bike to ride. We're just going to Old Gringley on the hill. This sign's along here saying new speed limit, 50 miles an hour. New. Been like it for about 10 years. Just coming into Everton. This is where Lenny says Uncle Dennis and Auntie Dorothy lived for many, many years. Somewhere over there. Usually our meeting point and departure point when I'm out with Bernard if you're coming out this way. Just coming into Bawtree. This is Bawtree. Another busy little place. Not as busy as it used to be, there used to be a market just there. Well here we are just dropping down into Tickhill. Came through Tickhill over an hour ago. It's been a real joy on this bike today. Really is an easy, enjoyable bike to ride. Just need to sort out some luggage. I've ordered a city bike. I might go and pick it up, I'll um, get a city bar bag and then I won't have to wear a rucksack, which I've got on today. There's the oak. Every Thursday night is bike night. My pal Bernard goes on his trike and he doesn't actually go into the car park because it's so busy. So he tries to go that little bit early and tries to park on the road outside so he can he do get blocked in when he wants to go. They used to call this the five lane ends, now they've made it into two roundabouts. Always known as five lane ends.
And here we are on our left, back to Crickhill Golf Course. I can't remember what time it was when we passed here. It's been a nice ride out of the back this afternoon. And we're coming back into Conisborough. And soon we're passing the castle again. I'll try and pull in so you can, uh, I can video it a bit better. There she is. There's Gunnersborough Castle, better picture than when I came earlier. Like I said, I spent hours here as a lad, rolling down those little hills there. They don't look too big today, but when you're 10 year old, they look massive. It's a lovely castle, we bring the grandchildren here quite a lot. Pastures Lodge, very popular pub. We get quite a few buzzards in this area, not far from home and a still nice day you can see I've seen up to five buzzards now coming up here on my left and there's a nice uh, restaurant here called the Bull Rush now we've never been we've never been but people are very nice but on Glenn's birthday March, we actually got a voucher from one of our friends. But as of yet, we haven't been. So here we are back at the Crown Pub, which we left two over two hours ago. So, um, look down at the clock, I've done 60 miles. Last couple of hours. So we're almost home, so I'll say thank you for watching. I hope to get another video together soon, and bye for now.